It's official fans will return to the Travelers Championship. Tickets went on sale today. The crowds will still be limited due to COVID-19, but it's much better than a year ago when the course was closed to spectators. Yeah, it sure is. And now there's news that some other rules at the TPC are being relaxed as well. Jim Altman has more from Cromwell. In golf speak, it's just a chip away. We call this final approach, right? The landing gear's down, we can see the runway, <laughs> lights are on. The 2021 Travelers Championship begins in a month. Welcome to the first round of the Travelers Championship. And before the drives, a welcome sight, irons and metal already in play. You have no idea how exciting it is to actually see things being built. For tournament director Nathan Grube, it's tangible. As of Tuesday, tickets officially on sale. And unlike 2020, 10,000 fans per day will once again flock to the fairways. To actually like have the day I can go and I have my ticket now to come to the tournament this year, um, it's, it's exciting stuff. And just announced, expect to see fewer face coverings on the course. We actually put this up on the site this morning um, when tickets are on sale that we're following CDC and the tourist guidelines that if you're fully vaccinated, you will not be required to wear a mask on property. But what we're also saying to people is, look, you know, if you're not vaccinated, we're asking you to wear masks. But yeah, that is that is new. And after last year, perhaps off the greens is where you'll find the biggest winners. Somebody said, hey, what's going to what's going to be you know, new or what, what are we going to see at the Travelers Championship this year? And I said each other. <laughs> You know, we're going to see each other. This is our event. This is our community's event. And people look at this as like a reunion time. I'm curious, Nathan, because it's 17 tournaments for you. Where does this one rank? Number one. Seeing it last year, standing there on the 18th green, and there were 38 people there. I mean, it was hard. And knowing what's coming back and knowing that we know what we missed, and that's coming back, this is the one that I'm most excited for. And a reminder, no paper tickets this year. Everything is being done digitally. We have all the ticket information on our website at fox61.com and on the Fox 61 News app. At the TPC River Highlands in Cromwell, Jim Altman, Fox 61 News. Such a great event. Great to see that people will be back there. Good to see it back, absolutely. We still have a lot more to get to in the Fox 61 News.